We serve a lot of carrots in child nutrition programs. So today I would like to show you how to dice and also cut these fresh carrots right into sticks because they are a great red orange vegetable. So first we're going to go ahead and we're going to peel. One thing I wanna show you, a lot of people do not know that the peeler has two sides. So you can actually use both of those sides on fruits and vegetables like this carrot here. So a lot of people will just cut or peel using the down motion, but you can actually peel going both ways and it makes it a lot faster, just like you see here. All right. So now let's go ahead and cut these ends off. You can cut the ends off before you peel or after. I like to do it after so I can kind of see where I need to cut it off. So now if you're going to cut this in sticks, you can cut it into three or two different sections. I'm kind of on the fence about this one because the end here is so small. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and cut it into three sections and I'm gonna show you why. So these are all about the same length. And so now what I wanna do is I wanna get these down to about the size of this when it's cut in half. So let me cut this in half. And now I can see the size of the halves because these make pretty good sticks. I could probably even cut these if I wanted smaller sticks in half again. So now I have my four sticks. Then I'm going to come over here and cut this into half, and then I might just do threes. So now you can see my sticks are all starting to be pretty uniform. Got a really skinny one in there, but that's okay. The kids aren't gonna mind. Okay, so now I'm gonna cut this one in half but I'm gonna go ahead and cut this one in fours. Remember, I cut the middle one in threes, but to get about the same size, I'm going to want to cut these into fours. So now you can see I have still some big ones. I might go ahead and cut this one in half, but the other ones still look pretty good. Maybe this one too, let's see here. All right, now I have all about the same size sticks. So if I want to go into a dice, I can go ahead and take these sticks and just dice them up. If I'm going to start with just dicing, I probably would start by just cutting that carrot right in half instead of cutting it into thirds because that would be more steps. So now we're just going to dice here. And again, we want to get these in about the same size pieces. The reason is, is because we want them to cook evenly. However, if we're going to cook these with celery or even maybe onions because we wanna make mirepoix, which is the combination of onions, carrots, and celery, then we may wanna cut the carrots just a little bit smaller than the onions and the celery because they take a little bit longer to cook. Or you could throw your carrots in first, maybe cook them five or seven minutes longer than the onions and celery. So just a few little tips. So there you go, beautiful, red-orange carrots.